Just a few isolated rain showers and some of those thunderstorms on live Doppler radar for early this evening, but things are quiet now in throughout far western Nevada and the Sierra. A few light showers now mainly to the north of Susanville, but across the other side of the state for eastern Nevada, widely scattered showers and some isolated thunderstorms crossing right over Highway 50. We did have a severe thunderstorm warning earlier just to the northeast of Eureka during the 4 o'clock hour. Your current temperature now on the valley floor comes in at 80 degrees, a northerly wind at 12 miles per hour, and a very low relative humidity at just 20%. Carson City is checking in at 77 degrees, right at 70 for South Lake Tahoe and Truckee, and into the lower 80s for our viewers in Fallon. On the latest series of satellite pictures with the radar, that area of low pressure is going to move away over the next couple of days. Replacing that low pressure system is going to be a ridge of high pressure building up now over the Pacific, and that ridge of high pressure system is going to crest over northern California and northern Nevada, so lots of sunshine over the next couple of days and really turning up the heat into the lower 90s fairly soon for the Reno Sparks area. Timing things out on future casts, clouds and precipitation once again overnight tonight, decreasing cloudiness and decreasing showers. And then for tomorrow morning on your Thursday, lots of sunshine, mostly sunny to sunny skies, but then watch as we increase the clouds in from the west, especially mid to late afternoon and very isolated showers, not so in the Reno Sparks area, but well to the north of Interstate 80 once again. Again, especially across Lassen County. Overnight tonight, as we saw in future cast, decreasing cloudiness and down to 50 with light winds on the valley floor. And then for tomorrow, a little bit warmer at 84 degrees, partly cloudy skies by the afternoon, as we saw in the model run, and a westerly wind between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. High temperatures for central and eastern Nevada warming things up over the next couple of days. Very isolated showers into the mix by tomorrow afternoon. Westerly wind between about 10 and 15 miles per hour. For our viewers in Fallon, coming in at 85 degrees, 77 across the far north in Winnemucca and into the upper 60s in Mammoth Lakes with the morning low down to about 40. So we're looking at sunny skies in the morning, increasing clouds by the afternoon and warming up those high temperatures, including 83 in the Smith Valley with the morning low at 42 and 84 in Yarrington with the morning low down into the upper 40s. Increasing clouds by the afternoon, but as we clear out tonight once again, Again, some areas of fog in Truckee with the morning low down to about 35 degrees. And overnight lows tonight to the north of Interstate 80 from the 40s to the 50s, warmest towards Pyramid Lake for Sutcliffe and Nixon. Increasing clouds for the second parts of your day, westerly wind between about 5 and 10. Here's a look at your extended forecast and look at Saturday, mostly sunny skies and 90 degrees. So the warmest air of the year so far is coming our direction. Another area of low pressure tries to come in Sunday and Monday for breezy conditions, a very slight chance for showers on Monday. And your extended forecast for Carson City, we're looking at very hot high temperatures on Saturday into the upper 80s, and even warmer air is on the way for the Lake Tahoe Basin as well. So a pretty good-looking weekend. Joe. All right, we like that to look forward to. Thanks, Brandon. And still to come on News 4 at 5, thousands of college graduates are now entering the job market. And now it's time to think about looking professional. We'll talk about how to do that on an entry-level salary. Straight ahead.